Do a catchy intro. That's a catchy intro. What's up guys, I'm Mackenzie and welcome to a Q&A on a Sunday. If you guys enjoy the video today, be sure to hit the like button, subscribe, comment, and video suggestions down below. And yeah, I haven't done a Q&A in a while since Christmas, I believe. Or no, since I hit a thousand subscribers. And I went on Instagram and Twitter and I asked you guys for some questions. You sent in a ton load, about 60, 70. This is, I think, the most it's ever been before. Unfortunately, I cannot answer them all. Some of the ones that I'm not going to answer in this video, I've already answered in previous Q&A. So if you want to go check them out, there's a link to a playlist with all my Q&A. So go check it there and if your question is an answer here it might be one of those videos so go check that out link in the description but let's just get into the questions do you enjoy being sexy <laughs> yeah all the time would you rather poop a brick or piss an egg poop a brick yeah i'd i'd, I'd poop poop a brick that, that's ah uh. what games do you play other than FIFA. Well, I play lots of games on my games channel, not on this channel, but on my games channel. So if you want to go check it out, yet again, there's a link in the description to my games channel. Go check it out. We have lots of games playing, and the moment is mostly The Walking Dead. We also have games like Little Big Planet, Destiny, GTA, free games off the PlayStation Market, Minecraft, lots of videos, lots of games. Go check that out, link in the description. I upload pretty much as frequently as I do on this channel, a little less because the videos are a little longer. But yeah, go check that out. It'd be a massive help. It'd like, I'd I couldn't thank you guys enough if you could go just check that out. Anyway, thank you. Can you do Minecraft videos? Like I just said, I do lots of games on my games channel, and yes, I could do Minecraft videos. I do a little bit of Minecraft here and there, but I want to start getting into a series, hopefully on the PC or on my PlayStation. Whatever happens, just let it happen. What game would you like to be in, in real life? I'm guessing you're talking about which game I would like to put myself in and like live in a real life kind of system like that. Thinking about that, it'd be something like Pokemon. That would be an absolute amazing thing to be in. Like, like you just get your own animals for like pretty much free and they do whatever you tell them to do and they push fire at their mouths and they shoot water. That'd be pretty sick. Another one would be Dragon Ball Z. That'd be awesome. That was another thing I loved as a kid. But then again, Dragon Ball Z was more of a TV show before a game, so I don't know if you can count that one. Harry Potter yet again, that was a game. That would be pretty sick but yet again it's more of a movie or a book even i guess i like the walking dead not not because i'd like to be eating the live but like that's probably the only downside to it all it'd be a pretty good thing to be in because you know it's just not real like you don't feel anything that'd be an awesome situation to be in without ever getting hurt or losing anyone properly yeah that would um That'd be a good thing. And, and probably FIFA as well. FIFA, I guess. Just being in FIFA. You know, being one of those players, being messy, that'd be pretty cool. If you could live somewhere other than Australia, where would it be? It'd be either New Zealand or England. That's a pretty simple question for me because New Zealand, that's where my family are. And England, that's where pretty much everything else is that I'd want to be at. Would you rather be as good as a FIFA goalkeeper when you can play football? Or support the freaking as bad as a FIFA goalkeeper, obviously. Look, I could be a bad goalkeeper and make mistakes every game. You know, people aren't going to just criticize me for the rest of my life. Like, I'm not going to be struggling with life. But if I was a Liverpool supporter, you get looked down on by everyone. And I don't want, like, why would you even want that? You'd kind of be ashamed of yourself. Like, how, how would you be able to sleep at night with that on your on your shoulders? I couldn't, I couldn't think about it. At least being with a goalkeeper, like, it's only lasts for 90 minutes. That lasts for a lifetime. And... Ugh. Who's your favorite Everton player and why? Kevin Morales because he's a beast. Why do you go Everton? I'm pretty sure she means why do you go for Everton or why do you support Everton? That's because my dad is from England as I've mentioned in previous q and So yeah, there we go. What's the difference between Chelsea and Google Chrome? Chrome as history. <laughs> Can you lick your arms? Slap cam someone. Alright guys, so um, we're gonna go and we're gonna slap cam someone. Hey um... Yeah, come, uh, just wait a sec. He's coming, he's coming. Oh yeah, yeah, what do you, uh, what do you want? Have you got a girlfriend? If so, will you do a video with her? Yes, I do, as I've said in every single pre previous Q&As. Yes, I do, and would I do a video with her? I wish I could. I've been asking for like months now. I've been going at it for months about it. And I would love to. I would love to do a video with her because it'd be, I think, jokes would be a fun video to do. But unfortunately, she can't or she's not allowed or something like that. So that's unfortunate. Maybe in the future. Maybe, 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 maybe. Okay. If Courtney didn't exist, what would you be? So if you people don't know who Courtney is, she's my girlfriend, of course, that's her name. And if she didn't exist, I guess. I'd be a real boy. 
If you could meet one player, who would it be? I'm guessing you mean like a football player, and I'm guessing you mean present time that's still play. I'm get I would probably say someone like Kevin Morales, obviously, because he's one of my favourite players. Someone like Ross Barkley, or then just someone obviously like Ronaldo, Messi, Neymar, not Suarez. Would you rather watch transsexual midget BBW porn or gay porn? Well, um, I have no idea what transsexual midget BBW porn is, so um, okay, that's that's weird. Uh, yeah, I'd, I'd go with that. I guess I freaking no idea what it is, but I'd go with that. What do you do first thing in the morning? Well, I guess it's not gonna be watching transsexual midget BBW porn. I guess yeah. Are you gay? Are you gay? Do you suck the D? What is with these? What's what is with these questions? What? what? No. Well, sometimes. Have you ever robbed something from a shop before? Well, I'm not sure about you, but uh, I... It's not kind of something I'd do, you know? Do you have a pet? Yes! I have a dog. When or how did you become interested in becoming a YouTuber? Back in, I think, 2012, maybe to the end of 2013. No, it was 2012, I believe. Just seeing people have fun playing games and recording themselves and me being myself playing FIFA a lot and recording heaps of sick... Oh, I wasn't actually recording. I was just scoring lots of heaps, heaps of sick goals. That just made me want to show everyone what I could do, and since then I haven't been able to score good goals apart from squad builders, which I enjoy the most, because that is originally what this channel is going to be, career mode and squad builders, but neither of them ever exist really, they're just never there. How do you have so much time to upload every day? I don't know. I, I really don't have enough time. I put off so much stuff, like you guys don't even know how much even someone like me getting a video or two videos up a day, around about 11 a week, you don't know how hard that is to actually constantly upload record, render, upload, edit, everything. It just takes forever to do that kind of thing. I don't know how I have the time. I put off a lot of things. I don't know how I, enough, I have enough time. It's just commitment, really. What advice would you have for someone who is thinking of starting YouTube? Just be yourself. Don't be annoying. Do what you enjoy. Listen to your subscribers. If you had a comment on your video, reply back to it. Don't just ignore people. Don't go and post yourself on everyone else's YouTube channel. So that's the most annoying thing. It's only going to bring you hate. But yeah, just pretty much be yourself. Do what you enjoy and just keep going at it. How old were you when you started YouTube and why did you start YouTube? I was 14 and I, as I said before, I started because I really wanted to enjoy doing that and it was something that looked really interesting so I started it. Yeah, I was 14 when I started. List your five favorite YouTubers. Hard. Very, very hard this one. Alright, so for my favorite YouTubers, I'd probably say fifth is age. J3 FIFA, fourth would probably be Spencer FC, third would be Adriano, second would then be Mini Minto, and first would be Max Mofo. Or I might put PewDiePie ahead of AJ3. I don't know, one of the, just one of them for fifth, just that really. Why did you come out with MNW as your channel name? Well, literally, I thought for months this was one of the hardest things for me personally to start my channel. I couldn't think of a good name. I, didn't, I wanted something catchy, something short, something that didn't sound like I was 10, and it, it just took so long because everything everyone was suggesting, I'm like, I'll get picked on for that name. I'd be embarrassed to have that name. I don't want that name. That's kind of the thing I would have had when I was six, so I'm not going to have that. And then I just came up with MNW for my initials. So there you go. That's. Why it's M and W? Are you going on any trips? In fact, I am in July. I'm going to the Gold Coast for like a week. I don't even know. I can't. I don't know yet. Well, I do know. I just can't remember. But yeah, I'm going to the Gold Coast. So yeah. Will you be doing any in real life blogs slash soccer? I don't know. I really want to be doing in real life videos. Apart the thing that I have to record and what I've done the intro and every cutaway is this. And um, this does not record for very long, it has about a two minute before it goes, ah, I can't record because I've recorded freaking photos. So yeah, I don't have a camera to record vlogs, I use my phone, but that has 16 gigs so it runs up really quick, it's hard to get it onto my laptop, doesn't work for some reason, lots of problems, but if I were to get a camera, I would do lots of stuff like that, and I would do a football video, yes, because that would be enjoyable for myself. But we gotta get a camera first. What's your target for subscribers by the end of 2015? Thanks, bro, but I don't really set myself targets anymore because whenever I do, I just fail to meet them and ends me. It makes me end up being disappointed. I just go with the flow, hope for the best. But I gotta say, by June, I think when the year from when my YouTube channel started, I want to hopefully have 2,500 subscribers. If you guys could help me get there, that'd be insane. But yeah, that's the goal for when I get to the year of my channel. But by the end of the year, I think if I can reach 2,000. 2500 by July. I think 10,000 subscribers could be realistic if I go hard out at it and I get lucky at one video. It could be lucky or just something happens. 10,000 could be the goal by the end of the year. And a reasonable goal as well. But guys, that is where we are going to end the q and I hope you have enjoyed. Be sure you hit the like button, subscribe, comment, and the video suggestions down below. If you have any more questions, comment them down below and I will answer them there. Also, it would be massive help if you can go check out my game channel. That I'm trying to get it going, but it's just so hard about it. It's so hard.
If you want to see me do videos with my girlfriend, comment that down below. Just spam the comments. Just massive go. If we can get this video to 35 likes, that'd be insane. If you haven't subscribed already, be sure to subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. I love you. Have a nice day. And I'll see you later.